Let's do some examples using the comparison test. Let's start by investigating the convergence or divergence of this series. We could actually use the integral test for this. It's simple enough, but let's use the comparison test. And a downside of the comparison test is that to use it, we really need to have some intuition going in about whether this series converges or diverges. Because to use the comparison test, we need to do one of two things. We need to find a larger convergent series, or we need to find a smaller divergent series. And if we don't go into this with any intuition, we won't know which of those we're trying to do. So let's try to think this through. 5n minus 1 is a polynomial. As n gets bigger, and bigger, 5n minus 1 should look like its a leading term. So when n is large, 5 over 5n minus 1 should look like 5 over 5n or 1 divided by n. So when n is large, and of course n is getting large, it's going to infinity here. If n is large, this series should start to look like the harmonic series. And the harmonic series diverges. So based on that, I'm going to guess that that series also diverges. And now I'm going to try to use the comparison test to formalize my intuition. If we want to show that a series diverges using the comparison test, what we need is a smaller divergent series. And we ask how can we make these terms is 
smaller. If you're trying to shrink terms to find a um, divergent series, there are two standard ways of doing that. To make a fraction smaller, for heavens, sorry about that. To make a fraction smaller, we either decrease the numerator or increase the denominator. So 5n minus 1 is less than 5n. So if we replace this smaller denominator with a larger denominator, that will cause this fraction to shrink. So these terms are greater than these terms. The harmonic series diverges. So this the series we are looking at uh, written a bit sloppily, but the series we're looking at also diverges. I think that's it for this video. We'll do a second more complicated example and it's own video. Uh,